Hello, this is uh, my wife, Latanya Thomas. Hello. And we're going to discuss the how interesting our love is in our relationship. So um, tell us what makes our relationship so interesting, our love for one another. Um, just the fight that we both have, um, just when we go through the ups and downs, the love that we show each other to get back on course. Okay, can we be? Can you be a little bit more specific about what what's different about our relationship that's not the same in other relationships? Well, we have arguments. Um, we can always come back and talk about what we messed up at, and we can admit as um, mature adults, admit what we were wrong, and try to get better. Um, we have a fight not to give up, to make it work, not just for us but for the kids as well. Right. And in and, 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 and throughout the relationship and all the ups and the downs, things that we've been to, what makes you what makes you hold on? What what inside of you makes you want to keep making this work? Because I have faith in my husband and I wanna see the other side of us growing old together and, you know, doing things together and raising our kids together. So that is what makes makes me fight and believe. That's good. And now we're going to talk about uh, attachment. And uh, this is a very interesting topic because uh, when I married my wife, she already had four children, and I took them on to be my own children. And uh, we also have a new introduction to the family. His name is Makai Eli, but he's asleep. He's supposed to be starring in the video, but maybe we can get him later. And um, yeah, but the, the attachment was interesting with us because uh, the, the definition says attachment is a term for the intense emotional tie that develops between two individuals, such as the tie between an infant and a parent or between adult lovers. And so the tie, did the tie get stronger with Makai? Even though we had ties because of the other children, do you think that that took our relationship to another level? Yes, I do. And uh, just just to give a, re a brief recap of some of the things that happened, um, my wife, she had an emergency C-section, and um, that put us closer together as a couple because it put me in a situation where I had to do a little bit extra, a, a little bit extra because she's not able to do the things that she usually was able to do. And also in the relationship with the kids, you know, it, it also makes the relationship interesting because it's almost as if uh, I get I get to love the same person six different times. And so, um, what do you think about that? When I think about you getting to love the same person six times, mm -hmm. that is so sweet. I mean, I'm almost breathtaking and can't, speechless, can't say anything, but um, that's my first time my husband ever told me that. But I think it's awesome um, that you see um, me and each one of the kids. That's powerful. Well, uh, just to talk a little bit more about... Uh, relationship and love this this love relationship to explain to me the relationship and the love that you have toward the kids um it's kind of hard to explain but as a mother it's a different type of love um from anybody else's um you know you, you're doing anything for your kids you want nobody to hurt your kids and you know when they're away from me I'm almost, almost like sick and you know, I just, it's just, I just, I just really can't even explain the attachment, the love that you have, the bond that you have with your kids when you have kids. It's interesting because we have uh, there's a table here that basically talks about uh, how willing would you be to marry someone who had more education than you. And surprisingly, uh, women chose five point seven out of seven. Men chose, I guess men don't mind if they're women and educated or not because they chose uh, five out of seven. Uh, had less education than you. Uh, we see both parties 
shows in between the four and five range out of seven. 